Good afternoon. This is Dorothy Simon sitting in for Jim Lakey over at Cable Channel 3. And you can also get us on the web at sandylandcenter.org. And even better than that, come by and visit us any morning between 9 and 12. And they're always smiling, friendly faces waiting for you and a great cup of coffee right over here at the Shepherd Center. And this is the day I think a lot of us have been waiting for. It is Friday. It's the end of the week. And if you've had a busy week, um, look forward to a great weekend. The weather forecast looks as if it's going to be a good one for the weekend. Over the greater Midwest, a high pressure system emanating from the Great Lakes will keep much of the area um, very dry at least for today and this will cause the humidity of course to um, fall with the high temperatures in the 60s to the near uh, in the 70s to the near 80s this warming trend will bring the temperatures um, keep the temperatures at the 80 degrees over the weekend for the highs and the thunderstorms and the showers it's they seem as if they've been confined to the southern areas areas to the south of us but right now in the square, it's mostly cloudy and it's a very pleasant 74 degrees with uh, the winds, barely, hardly any winds, uh, just maybe 5 to 10 miles per hour, 84% humidity. Uh, and during the next um, six hours, it is expected to be mostly sunny with temperatures rising to a high of 79 or 80 degrees at the most and the winds will stay in that slow pattern coming in mostly from the south and the southeast and there's a slight chance of some thunderstorms at night time and then the temperatures will go down to 62 degrees uh, with partly cloudy, cloudy skies. And the weekend like I say will bring intervals of cloud and sunshine and during the day on Saturday, it is partly cloudy with the high of 81 and the nighttime low of 61, 20% chance of rain. Similar pattern for Sunday with the high of 81, the lows maybe of 64, mostly sunny on Sunday. It just seems like beautiful outdoor temperatures for the family activities and enjoy um, good weather. Um, for the weekend. Um, in our community right now um, we have some birthdays. We want to wish uh, JD Hager a uh, happy birthday. Happy birthday JD. If you see him do the same. And we have some anniversaries. Um, Wish the happy couple of Melvin and Norma Gray um, a happy anniversary. Also, Lawrence and Jennifer, Jennifer Gillespie. Uh, and on the 19th, wish Barry and Lynette Bennington. And on the 20th, um, Jesse and Gladys Garcia. Wish them all. Um, what happy wedding anniversaries. Some activities in the in the square this afternoon and the square starting at 3 p.m. Um, that's the afternoon in the square is being sponsored by the Eden Valley Church uh, and they're hosting this event to support a uh, mission activities in um, Guatemala. Um, they're not charging, but they will take donations, and uh, it is for a good cause. And I know they do a lot of good work with the children down in Guatemala. So do come out. It promises to be a nice afternoon and support the pe people at the Eden Valley Church. And there will be just um, lots of musical entertainment right around 4 o'clock with bands and different singing groups singing bluegrass music and at 5 p.m. they promise to serve a delicious supper. So come on out and support them uh, this afternoon. 
other activities um, in for community. On Tuesday, there will be the monthly commodity distribution uh, at the Sunflower Center. Do remember that if you're picking up uh, commodities for someone, they will ask for you to sign a form and um, it's just required by the powers that be, so remember that. And on August the 19th, uh, the Ministerial Alliance is sponsoring a breakfast for the school. Um, it just doesn't seem like the summer is <laughs> over and it's back to school. But it is back to school time and the, the Ministerial Alliance are sponsoring the wonderful breakfast for the, the school district. Um, or right now, over at the Second Chance, they're having a basket sale. And it's just $4, $4 for anything you can pack in the basket. So come on out and support the, the Ministerial Alliance. They have a basket sale. Like I say, it's just $4. And whatever they do, also go to support the Ministerial Alliance and all the good causes that they do. And... We have uh, on our menus for today over at the Sunflower Center, they have some delicious meatloaf served with parsley, um, potatoes, a seasoned salad uh, with mixed vegetables, uh, a tossed salad, and a lemon meringue cake, um, bread, and milk and coffee as usual. And it sounds like that meatloaf is very delicious. And over at Maxwell Center, today they're serving a Salisbury steak with pasta salad, a tossed salad with pepper and peaches. And on Monday, it promises to be oven fried chicken, mashed potatoes, stewed tomatoes, and sherbet. And on Tuesday, a pepper steak, rice, oriental vegetables, and bread. And an ancient cake served with strawberries. Again, all very good eating. And please, if you need those nutritious meals, call them up or better still go over there and enjoy the meal. And don't forget now the commodity distribution on Tuesday. And or thought for the day. If you are patient in one moment of anger, you will escape a hundred days of sorrow. If you're patient in one moment of anger, you're, you will escape a hundred days of sorrow. So be happy and don't be angry. Have a great weekend and enjoy the outdoors.